Pulse, sponsored by Palomar Health. We have our fingers on the pulse of the USD women's volleyball team, and not only will the Toreros play in the NCAA tournament for the 23rd time in 25 years, they will also play host to the first two rounds. Julian Delgado has a look at the Torero team that finished the season ranked second in the nation. I think all season it's just been like, why not us? It's kind of been our motto, and why not us? Because we work really hard and we really enjoy like playing the sport with each other. Why not the Toreros, who come into the NCAA tournament as the number two seed in their region and host site for the first time in nine years? It's what we're shooting for every single season to be one of those top 16 seeds, to be in our home environment, to be in front of our home crowd. It's electric here in the Jenny Craig, and um, we're super excited to showcase what we have been working on all season. What a season it was! USD finishing the year 27 and one overall, undefeated in West Coast Conference play and riding a 24 match winning streak. It's nice to finally have it arrive. Um, we've been looking forward to it and not wanting to get ahead of ourselves all season, but this is, you know, this is the most exciting part of the year and uh, they're ready. Mount Carmel High School alum and Torero head coach Jennifer Petrie has taken her team dancing in 23 out of the 25 seasons she's been on campus, earning WCC Coach of the Year for this group's latest campaign. There's no <laughs> such thing as a coach of the year, in my opinion. It is a coaching staff and I have got the best in the country. Awards didn't stop there for the Toreros, who took home three other all-conference accolades, including Libero of the Year in Annie Benbow, Setter of the Year in Gabby Blossom, and Player of the Year in Katie Lukes, who led the team with 364 kills and counting. I mean, everything that I've earned is an honor. Everything our team has earned is an honor. I mean, I just think that stuff's amazing, but I think that like this whole where we are as a team is much more important to me and I would not be where I am or, or, or like earning any awards that anybody else. So USD's NCAA tournament quest begins on Thursday, December 1st, right here inside the Jenny Craig Pavilion. They will take on Northern Colorado match time set for 730 p.m. For now, reporting on the campus of USD, Julian Delgadio, Fox 5 Sports.